Hey guys, so um, I kind of wanted to talk about something. It's probably not like the greatest time to do this, seeing as like lighting in here is really, really bad and everything, but I just wanted to talk about um, intimacy. And um, sorry for my fingernails being dirty. I was doing art earlier. I wanted to talk about why I have such a problem um, connecting with people and I realized that during class I was doing a lot of like a lot of like whoo, like freaking out over like the family stuff and like discussing that kind of thing and I realized that it occurred to me that my family has never been a very close like lovey-dovey um, all in all the time type family. We've always been very distant, very not touchy, very not lovey. And I've realized that because of this, it has given me pretty severe intimacy issues. And not just because of that, it's also because of like childhood neglect and things like that. But I, I've realized that the reason that I feel like I'm absolutely disgusting and that I will never have anyone is because my family kind of treated me like I wasn't worth their time so sometimes I just feel like I'm not like a person who is capable of dating and I'm not like a person who is I don't even know what to say. I'm just, I'm, I'm not like a person who's capable of love and I'm not a person who's capable of connecting to someone on a very deep level. And I don't know if it's because of my family or if it's just my own issues. I want more than anything to connect to someone on a very deep level. And unfortunately I have never been able to do that because of my childhood and because of my anxious attachment um, style of, you know, attachment and things like that. I keep having this feeling every time I see like someone with like a partner or like getting married, I keep having this feeling it's like, you will never be that person. No one is ever going to put up with you for long enough to marry you, to um, get engaged to you. To, no one is ever no one is ever going to look at you and say i want that person in my life forever and so all i can think is why do i feel this way is it because like my family has made me feel this way or is it because of something that I've done? Is it, um, is it something that I've like brought upon myself? And I just kept thinking like, why do you feel like literally this has nothing to do with looks guys? I might be the ugliest girl on this entire planet, right? I might be so ugly and, and hideous. And unattractive people can find love, right? Right? That's... I just... I want to be able to wake up and be able to trust. I want to be able to love and I want someone to be able to love me, but that is very difficult because love and trust and those things don't happen in an instant, they happen over time. So me loving and trusting someone, that would take years and I just feel like it's never going to happen. I don't know why. I'm afraid. I'm afraid of people. I'm afraid of dating. I'm afraid of intimacy. I mean, like TMI guys, but I'm literally like, 
I, I'm a virgin. I've never, like, even really been with anyone. At this point, I'm afraid of dating. I'm a Gen Z, so, like, I guess my, my generation is afraid of dating or something, or maybe they're not. I don't really keep up with that crap, but I'm afraid. And I don't know if it's, like me or if it's just like everyone in my generation like all I know is that I feel unattractive I feel just quite literally disgusting all the time with my face and my body checking has gotten really bad and it's like Physical intimacy is so important to people, like, physical attraction is so important to people, and all I can think in my mind is like, you're not enough, you're ugly, you look terrible, you know, you have premature, like, wrinkles on your face, and you've got, like, like, ugly, you're just like... <laughs> like... <laughs> I'm so afraid of someone, of liking someone and having them tell me you are too ugly for me, no thanks and having them just like blow me off completely that literally is why I don't even try anymore <laughs> I don't even try to date I feel too ugly and I feel too weird And in class, we're talking about perfectionism. I, I don't know where my perfectionism like ends and like my body dysmorphia begins and where my real, where reality is and it's like, <laughs> like I can't be so ugly that no one would ever like me, right? Like that can't be true. And we went over like some statistics in class, like, um, like how, you know, um, on dating apps, like tall people, tall men get swiped on, swipe right more, and it's like, if you're not attractive, if you're not like tall, it's like, your chances of finding someone are like way less or something. I shouldn't even be focusing on dating. It's just, I'm worried about my future. I'm worried about dating. I'm worried about love. I'm worried about like, I'm having a quarter life crisis. I'm only 23 and I'm having like a complete like mental breakdown over things that could still happen. You know, like things that could still happen for me maybe. But that's the problem. Like I don't, I can't tell the future, so how am I supposed to know if they're gonna happen or if they're not gonna happen? Or if someone's gonna come out and like, like, confess their love to me and then I fall in love with them and it's like... This is what, this is what idiots worry about, right? Right? Can you guys tell me that I'm being stupid right now? Can you tell me that I'm being stupid? Because like... I feel like I'm gonna be alone forever because of my intimacy issues because I'm weird, because I, like, I'm not perfect, because, like, I have got, like, weird lines on my stupid, the stupid lines on my face, like, are you guys dating me? Anyway, I'm having, like, a complete breakdown over this crap. This is, like, this is probably some of the stupidest stuff that I've had, like, a problem with in a long time. And yet here I am having a problem with it on video for everyone to see. And it's like, oh, that's so great. Oh, whatever. Anyway, I couldn't do a traditional video today. The lighting in my room is like all out of whack. So like shadows were all in weird places, but I'm afraid. I'm afraid of dating. I'm afraid of not dating. I'm afraid of being single. I'm afraid of not being single. I'm afraid. And I'm never gonna find someone and I am randomly in my bathroom crying about it sometimes um, 
Again, I'm sorry about how dirty my nails are. I was doing art earlier. <laughs> Sorry for having a complete freak out. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I appreciate you. And um, maybe I'll upload tomorrow.